The need to safeguard the lives of children cannot be overemphasized because they are the future leaders of society. However, in sub-Saharan Africa, Zambia is among countries that is faced with high illiteracy levels due to the majority people living below the poverty line. This barrier to better living is a social economic hurdle that the Zambian government cannot tackle alone minus the input from stakeholders. One such stakeholder is Media Network on Child Rights and Development, MNCRD, in conjunction with other non-governmental organizations that have partnered with government in spearheading early childhood care and education in Zambia. In this vein, the Child Advocacy Group recently embarked on a bus campaign from Lusaka which covered four districts, namely Mumbwa, Kaoma, Mongu, Senanga, as target locations for championing the rights of young children. Upon arrival in Mumbwa, the Intuarich paid a courtesy call on the district commissioner, Sandy Shamavanse. The commissioner thanked the organization for initiating a program for the less privileged in society. The activists later took time to share their awareness messages to the residents before departing on a long journey to Kaoma district. In Kaoma, the campaign made its presence known when residents were mesmerized with local popular songs, hence the message reaching its intended audience. <laughs> And before departing for Senanga, residents from the provincial capital willingly took part in endorsing their signatures as child ambassadors. The final stop was Senanga, a vibrant town lying on the banks of the mighty Zambezi River. The town's tranquility and friendly residents made the bus campaign a success. The initiative is timely in addressing the plight of the poor in society as attested by Senanga District Commissioner Mitupolo Yumei. For these children, the onus is on their parents to uphold the rights of children through early childhood care and education. Clive Kalunga, Movie TV News in Senanga, Western Province.